Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials. Right now, trading up 105. NASDAQ is up 185. S&P is up 23. Gold. Gold contract down $11, trading at 1838 an ounce. We have silver down 29 cents, $21.68 an ounce. Light sweet crude down 860. That's taking a hit out here. 108.98. Notes and bonds. The 10-year note right now up 12 ticks, trading 116.06. The 30-year up a full point, plus eight ticks of 131.21. And king dollar, folks, check it out, man. You just can't keep it down. We got down 1,400 ticks yesterday. Well, guess what? We're back up 1,000 ticks today. This is going to get dicey, man. We're at 104.669. Euro right now is at 104. You got the yen trading out at 134.97. And the British pound is at 122 to 1 US dollar. We can expect coming into this close, folks. Bottom line, I expect the uh, s and is probably to be flat. Uh, you're gonna have monster volume coming into the close. It's, um, you know, bottom, bottom line quad witching. Um, this, where we are right now, folks, is building cause for the next leg down. Well, the next leg down actually started, but when you get a day like yesterday, you know, bottom line, that took a lot of energy out of the marketplace. What we are gonna have here, and this is what is too bad, uh, you know, because it's a bearish occurrence. Because of the amount of volume we're gonna get into the close, you're actually gonna have a lower low with volume. You know, no matter what happens, you can go up right now and have a lower low with volume because we've already got lower than the prices of yesterday. That's how it shakes out. Gold, we look at a gold market out here. Every time the gold market gets a shot at it, guess what? You get a pullback. That being said though, you're only coming back with 132,000 contracts. That's big, light volume, no doubt about it. So, still has a shot. And good old King Dollar. Look at this King Dollar, man. This is something else. So, King Dollar. Oh, I like this, though. Okay. This is good. This is almost a, it's not a failure, but... So, yesterday, we went from uh, 105, 493 down to 103, 416. Today, we made it up to 105, 085. But we're at 104, 674. So, check this out. This is... Oh, this is cool, man. This was a test once again of the highs that were generated out here in May. That number, 105.005. We went to 105.085 and gave it up. That's a good situation. That's telling me this dollar is going to give it up. And, you know, if you're a bull, you want this dollar to give it up, even in the broad market. It'll make things a little bit easier. At ABC, down, my take is we're going to finish it in spades. But, you know, bottom line, you need some some kind of catalyst uh, if you're thinking there's going to be any kind of buying in this market in general. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.